Mixup Software Update, Controlling the Spinner Platform and GoPro from the Mixup App, Admin Mode for Controlling the Booth, Slow Mo Video Settings, and much more. Now more about the new features. Notification window indicates errors in the booth. If the red dot is lit, go to the tab and there you can see the errors and possible solutions to the problem. Wireless connection window. If this is the first time you are connecting your GoPro camera to the booth or you have reset its connection settings, you should do the following. In the GoPro settings, select new connection. In the program, go to the Pair Camera tab, find your GoPro, select your GoPro, click Connect, then click Scan. The camera will automatically connect to the booth. Spinner Platform has been added to the Scene Control window. There are two options of connection via Bluetooth and USB. You can set the value of rotation speed. You can also change the acceleration value on newer revisions of the booth. From the same tab you can start and stop the platform to check the speed value settings. Scan to find the device via Bluetooth. If you physically connect via USB, no additional operations need to be performed. Connect the RGB backlighting of the spinner booth in the additional Pixel tab. Preferences window. The Use Virtual Keyboard has been added. Now when you click in the text field you have a virtual keyboard. Use Hotkeys. You can use hotkeys to remotely control capture in admin mode. Page up to start or stop the capture. Page down to start and stop the spinner when it is connected. In the Camera and Chromakey tabs you can take a test shot using the Page Up button. Camera window for Canon DSLR. You can set a custom exposure for the live view. This helps you customize shooting with a flash or in difficult lighting conditions. You will see the result of the adjustment in real time. In the video mode, there is now a FPS setting. You need to set the FPS to the same as on the camera. GoPro. Now you can work with GoPro cameras. Supported GarPro cameras, GarPro 10, 11, 12. If you work via USB, you will need to put an additional program link is under the video. By setting the FPS value from the program it will change and on the camera itself. Unfortunately, GoPro cameras do not output live view while recording and it is not available. Project window. There appeared an opportunity to upload a custom photo preview. The icon toggles the preloaded preview and works if you have loaded previews for both photo and video. In the video editor window, you can select the FPS for the correct display of the original timeline. Set the FPS at which you are going to record the video. Now you can change the speed of video playback when adjusting individual video segments. Email sharing window. You can now edit the recipient's email address in the send queue and in the email database. After editing, the email is put back into the send queue. If you click on file name, the path to the desired file will be opened. Administrator mode is designed for the administrator to work with the booth. You can select the type of content, photo, video and templates. By the start button or page up button, you can start shooting. As soon as the shooting is over and the file is ready for processing, it is sent to the processing queue and from that moment you can shoot the next guests. Processing runs in the background. To stop the session you can click on the cross or page up. Info tab. If the icon is blue, everything is fine. If it is yellow, it is a warning about a non-critical error. If the icon is red, then there is a critical error, it can seriously affect the final result of the photo or video. When you click on it, you can see the status of the session and booth. From here you can also start shooting or start the rotation of the platform. If it is connected, start stop the platform can also be performed using the page down button. The info window is accessible from any other window in admin mode. 
You can also lock the screen by clicking on the lock icon. Unlocking can be done by entering a PIN code. PIN code can be turned on or off from the App Preferences tab. You can start shooting with hotkeys from the locked state as well. The gallery window is also available from the locked state. Thanks for watching.